I know, I know, I know. Y'all want to know what happened with Tina. I'm going to tell y'all. They say never say never. I say never tell me what to do. A person will never put you in a position above them. That's never a lie. Always true. Success never comes without risk and risk never comes without fear. YouTube is a smoking mirror. Never how it appear. If y'all remember that in the last video or the video before about the whole speed sensor when I had to stay down in St. Louis and spend the night, get up, go to Freightliner, get the speed sensor, put a new one in, everything was fine till I got back home, got some diesel, left the truck stop, it happened all over again. Well, my mechanic was like, check the speed sensor. I was like, Man, I just put that speed sensor in there. It ain't the speed sensor, it's something else. I didn't check the speed sensor. I went and dropped my trailer. I took it right to the shop. A few hours later, he sent me a picture. He sent me a text and he was like, go pick up a speed sensor and you'll be fine. I'm like, why would I need another speed sensor when I just put that speed sensor in there? So he sent me a picture of the speed sensor and this is what it looked like. So I was like, well, how did that happen? And apparently the speed sensor got a jam nut on it. And whoever put the speed sensor in did not hold the speed sensor in place while they tightened the jam nut up. So as that bright person tightened the jam nut up, the speed sensor was also turning and was down too far into the transmission. Now, why it waited all the way till I got home? I'm happy that it waited all the way till I got home. Why it waited that long? I have no idea. I got on that incline and something happened and the gears must have just hit the speed sensor. So if you ever had that, if you ever have to change your speed sensor, make sure you use two wrenches. I only had one wrench under there. I got a million wrenches in the truck. I didn't think, and I didn't tighten that jam nut that tight. I kind of just snugged it. Okay, to put the speed sensor in, you supposed to put it in and then back it out a quarter to a half a turn. I did all that. Tighten the jam nut up. I just really snugged the nut. Or maybe I did. Did I say I? The person that's put the speed sensor in said they just snugged the nut. But obviously, they did more than that. So that's what happened with Tina, man. That's why she was down. That's why I had to borrow my guy's truck. Um, it happens, man. It happens. All these years in the game, and it is what it is. Been through a lot of pain in my life, and I pray the Lord take it all away.